Barely able to survive against this Arise Magnus. The oh, there's gonna be a brawl at the top lane. On well, the son of Magnus, Yo, will he jump in? He doesn't have a flame guard for 14 seconds. Do they jump in? Oh, they will. They toss back Simba. They need some body blocks here. He has skilled Carapace, but it's not gonna save him. Completely caught in at the. Oh, actually, his his firefly is down. Oh, maybe it's not. He's in the tree line now, but the Doom worms his way through. And now Ace is trapped. He's got 15 seconds where he won't really have a great solution except just running. Now he's cornered and corralled, but they make up the trade here with the crit rotation. Big Daddy gonna tangle them out, and he will tank some tower shots with the heal. He'll be healthy for now. Too close to the creep still. Look at it go! They look for this jump on crit bottom. They will. The cast to start, but no follow-up from Puppy just yet. Now a stone gaze used by Kuro. Just for the slow, actually manages to turn him to stone. They're gonna go on this, and while that's happening, the trap is sprung mid lane, the skewer. Cancelled by a Nyx Assassin stun, or at least counter-engaged on, I should say. The Impale now coming out onto a rise. He'll end up falling. Secret spraying their trap mid, and they look for Ace as well. Puppy chasing forward. They'll find the kill. Mid after getting caught by Searing Chains. And then he'll end up going down. Now the lasso onto S4. It's been stolen by Crit. And they turn this one around the other way. He's thinking about it, but Big Daddy's there with the heal. Doing his best to keep S4 alive. It looks like that will counter the Doom damage. In fact, he's not really dropping at all. Nice. Oh, that's a nice way to attempt to deal with it. And S4 can go back in. He'll pop his bounty rune. He finds the chain. It's the death ward. Confidence no. from Big Daddy. Brain and Simba as well. And with the double invis, this is likely to be a death for Arise. He buys his blink dagger. If he blinks out instantly, he could survive. A half second too long, and he'll go down. The invis bros surround him. He gets impaled mid skewer. Brings Simba with him. Then finds the two here RP anyway. The game cooperating with Arise as S4 gets blasted back into the tower and Ice Blast. Gonna kill him off? But they do have Doom. If he gets the eggs, then it's a real problem. Nice. Kuro spotted out now as an observer was popped on the other side of the tree line. They pull in Kuro. He couldn't stone gaze in time and now he's out of mana. He'll end up falling there. Didn't turn off the mana shield. Wouldn't have mattered. As S4 looks for a chains, but he did not get off the Slate of Fist first. Do they still engage onto this? They're thinking about it. He's getting very aggressive. Charging in with a double damage rune. Secret want to fight. Fanatic want to back. Chains will be there. Finds Ace. Now that the Big Daddy ultimate. He's just not afraid to lob out a death ward anytime he thinks he can find a single kill. The puppy in the front line has the Doom ready, but Arise already got up his RP. Jumps on the S4. Kills him off. A nice cast. A really good ultimate from Big Daddy. That will end Tani's life. And then back to the other side of the engagement where a puppy. Dire Courier now respawning. Didn't have anything on it when it went down. And they'll find crit mid lane, goes in with the chains, the, the follow up will be there with the Slate of Fist. Now stealing flame dart though, they'll have to do this the good old fast way, the right click, the RI's RP is there, the follow up comes in from Hani. Dark pacting and leaping on through as the death ward's used to zone back the Slark. You go for that blink skewer play, try to pull him in. The I don't death know. push begins. Dun, dun, dun. Now Ace getting called out. Doom's there. The chain's on two. Great jump in from S4. The follow up impale secures that ancient apparition kill and looks for crit now. It's chase from S4. So aggressive, but he steals the remnant. Crit with a nice retreat out still. Here's the A ult. It's flying. Up the back Stalny on the Kroki, but hey, that's something to help take down the Dusa. Death more thrown, and they'll use the Stone Gaze momentarily. One down, two to fall, the perfect RP. Zero follow-off. Rise will drop as well. That's four heroes dead, counting the Aegis. And, well, Hani will try to retreat out, but he stands a little bit too long. Close to the enemy team, Chains was searching. Backup, even if this Dusa somehow falls. And Ember also synergizes well with Stone Gaze, if you can get off the actual proc. That's Double damage on off his physical. So go in now with an impale to start on Rise. The chains from S4 to cure that kill. They'll bring down the Ancient Apparition cleanly. Got off his ultimate, but that's it. And now look for Hani. Diva's will slow him a bit. Can he leap out to the high ground? Just barely managing to escape. Now they lasso Puppy. Carapace was searching and it will limit the damage. But Puppy still pulled back in. Crystal Doom will be nice perhaps for this upcoming. Jump in bottom lane on S4 perhaps, but they need some stunts here. I don't think Crit's go oh, with the Stolen Doom, he is good enough. Yeah, I forgot about that. There you go. Nice kill for Fnatic again. So, that's close to 6,000 effective HP. <laughs> there is a rush fight, I guess we should talk about this. As Puppy jumps in, they'll drop the low ground death ward for Big Daddy, but have no eyeballs, Ice. Or Ace, sorry, not Ice. Not taking any damage. They did Doom Arise. 
Uppy, good counter initiation there to try and secure that Roshan. The Aegis goes the way of the Medusa crit. Barely able to survive. They kill off S4, and then what? Do they have the follow-up to win this fight from here? Medusa at full HP. They even RP here, and still Kuro losing his mana shield with the empower of Slark ripping into him, now turning to focus on Big Daddy. Kuro surviving for the time being, but it's just him that's left standing. Last man. Go, might go down with the ship for this. Skewered finished off Fnatic with a massive turn. Can they fight again against Kuro? They Probably can. Probably their best bet, but Doom has, or Magnus actually has buyback right now. They jump in with an RP mid on Arise, then Skewer Puppy back in. Waiting his crit. Lasso also used on S4 during this time, but crit gets impaled. He's only stolen level death, didn't get the Doom. Arise will fall, crit. Next on the list is Kuro, charges forward. That's three heroes down. <laughs> oh no, Hani just bought his Abyssal one of buyback. That's GG if he dies. But he might not. That's the ultimate, and then the RP. Perhaps this will end up working out for Mr. Hani. Dude, if this ends up working, I just don't know anymore. Batrider will fall. Many questions here and few solutions for Fnatic. Speech continues, though. The Wrecking Crew is in the front lines. That's Kuro. Blink skewer from Arise was way short, and he gets three shotted by the Medusa. Oh, that's gotta be it. No RPs. 100 seconds on the sideline for him. Hani trying to duke it out, though. He's doing a lot of damage. 30 agility, but that's another lane of Rackstown. Melee exposed. Working on the range. Tani getting slowed down a bit. Remember. I think he might be sure to buy back here even after they're gonna finally will show mercy and come in to try and win this game. But before they do that, K God gets the kill on the mag. Now he'll focus the throw. It's all over. Fnatic, another loss in the summa two. Again, a decent showing from them, just not good enough. Yeah. Still secret looks vulnerable after this game and last, I'd say. And if we're going in, you're not like scared shitless as a team that has to face them. You're like, oh, you know, we can People can beat him. Yeah, between this and also uh, SO1, where they they got, I mean, they got manhandled.